Hello, today's video is on using your smart, smart board as a document reader. Basically, what your smart board can do for you is take a scanned image and allow you to uh, write on it as you would an overhead uh, transparency or using a regular document reader. What the smart board does is eliminate the need for either of those machines. Today I'm going to show you how to use your scanner using the smart notebook software to scan an image up onto your screen to use with your students. Using an, an, um, a brand new smart notebook file, you would go into insert picture from scanner and then what's going to happen is this box is going to appear. Hopefully you have a scanner attached to the computer that you're using the smart board on. The, the type of scanner will appear in the drop down menu and click scan. Now everyone's scanner is a little bit different and so your regular scanning information will show up here regardless, um, depending on the type of scanner that you have. As you can see the last thing I scanned is still here. Now my scanner gives me the option to um, use different kinds of materials to scan. I can preview it. We'll wait just a moment. I can also choose the size that I want it to come out and if I want it to be in color or in black and white. I'm just scanning the cover of one of my favorite books at this point. Once it finishes previewing, I will be able to adapt the size of it. If I just want the picture of the pie, I can adapt a little picture of the pie. Or I could just use the entire page like I would maybe a worksheet that I'm using in my class. When I'm finished adapting the size that I want it to be, I click Scan. The computer takes a moment to scan the information for me and when it is finished it's going to ask me what I want to do. I just want to retouch it and let it go into my smart notebook um, program. When it finishes I'll say OK and we'll be able to view it in the editing portion of the notebook and then also I will show you what it looks like to output it onto your smart board screen. We're almost finished here. I want to retouch and save the image, so I'll say OK. It's inserting the scan, scan picture. And here it is. This is the editing size, so I could write on it if I'd like to. When I'm ready to show it to my students, I click full screen, and it adapts the size on the edges so that you can see all that you are interested in seeing on the smart board. You can use this for worksheets, you can use this for pages of a book. Um, basically, the opportunities are endless, you get to choose. I hope this has been helpful. If you are attending my class, please bring a document that you would like to scan to use in your classroom. Have a great day.